Has the legacy of O.J. Simpson been defined by his illustrious football career or the infamous murder trial that followed? This question has sparked countless debates, and today we delve into the life of this once revered sports icon, who later became a figure of controversy. Born Orenthal James Simpson in 1947, O.J. Simpson grew up in San Francisco, California. His talent in football was evident from a young age. He played college football for the University of Southern California, USC, where he won the Heisman Trophy in 1968. Simpson's professional football career took off when the Buffalo Bills drafted him in 1969. He played for the Bills until 1977 and then finished his career with the San Francisco 49 ERs. His prowess on the field earned him a spot in the Pro Football Hall of Fame in 1985. However, Simpson's life took a drastic turn in 1994 when he was accused of the murders of his ex-wife Nicole Brown Simpson and her friend Ronald Goldman. The subsequent trial, often referred to as the trial of the century, was watched by millions and Simpson's acquittal led to polarized responses across the nation. In 2007, Simpson found himself in legal trouble again, this time for armed robbery and kidnapping in Las Vegas. He served nine years in prison before being released on parole in 2017. Sadly, O.J. Simpson passed away at the age of 76 after a battle with cancer. He leaves behind a legacy that continues to provoke discussion and debate. To summarize, O.J. Simpson's life can be seen as a tale of two halves. On one hand, he was a football legend, a Hall of Famer, and a Heisman Trophy winner. On the other hand, he was a central figure in one of the most infamous trials in American history and served time in prison for a separate crime. His life story serves as a stark reminder that success and fame can sometimes be overshadowed by controversy and personal downfall. As we remember O.J. Simpson, we are reminded that the legacy of a public figure can often be as complex and multifaceted as the life they lived.